Hey, what is going on guys? First you here, back with another video, and today's video I actually got some really exciting news to share with you guys. Now real quick before I get into this video, if you guys could drop a like on the video, I'd really appreciate that. Let's see if we can break 10 likes on this video. Also, if you guys are new to the channel, please be sure to subscribe for more content like this that I'm going to be trying to pump out as often as I can. Without any further ado, let's just get straight into this video. Now if you guys didn't know, there was just another update in Call of Duty Infinite Warfare, this one being over 3 gigabytes. And honestly, I think this update was the craziest one they have added yet. They have have just added 20 new prestiges to the game so starting from 1 to 10 there is now an additional 11 to 30 which is just absolutely insane this reminds me a lot of what advanced warfare did because they are now referring to the prestiges after 10 as master prestige levels and those prestige levels also offer you guys new bonuses such as an extra 25 experience bonus to your challenges so that's just crazy to me to think about I'm honestly so excited that they finally added more prestiges another thing that they also did was they changed the way the current procedures look a little bit this is now the second time they've changed the way the procedures look honestly I'm not really too much of a fan of the newer look of them I kind of like the other ones better but I'm definitely gonna get used to them because I don't even remember what the first one looked like when they changed it but the fact that they added another 20 procedures to the game is just crazy to think about it kind of makes you wonder what else are they gonna add to the game a lot of people have been speculating that they're gonna be more classic weapons which honestly I would be a huge fan of People have been saying that they saw the ACR in a melee from MW2 and 3 in the actual coding of Infinite Warfare. So if they were to add those two guns back as classic weapons that you get after like 11th prestige, I would honestly be totally down for that. It'd make a lot more people want to play the game and would also make another reason to grind in public match. So I think that that would definitely be a good idea for them to do, especially since people have already been saying that they saw it in the coding. So let me know what you guys think about adding more classic weapons to the game. Honestly, I think that'd be a great idea. But that actually concludes everything that I wanted to cover in this video. So I'm sorry that this video was a little shorter than my usual ones. I'm going to have another video out tomorrow, hopefully within the 5 p.m. to 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time Zone. I couldn't be as specific as I wanted to with the detail of this update because I haven't actually released the patch notes yet as I'm making this video. If we can break 10 likes on this video once they do actually release the patch notes I will make another video about everything that you guys will need to know about that update. For right now I'm kind of just rolling with what articles have said about the whole update without the patch notes actually being released but that's pretty much going to wrap up this video. Don't forget to subscribe to me on my channel if you guys are new. I really want to get my name out there. I've been producing a lot of quality content. A lot of people that have come to my channel have told me directly in comments and all over the place that my content is really really good for my amount of subs so if you guys could just do me a huge favor hitting that sub button get my name out there so more people can see the content i'd really appreciate that i'm on the road to 300 subscribers and until next time guys i am out peace